traditional way we have been doing service, charity, is doing programs for the poor. And many times that has taken, uh, has become a way of creating dependency uh, rather than self-sufficiency. And essentially says that uh, uh, if we do for others what they have the capacity to do for themselves, we disempower rather than empower them. I've had time to be in the homes of some of the recipient families when the gift bearing families arrived. And I saw something that was that was disturbing to me. Of course, the kids were all excited. This is like Santa Claus coming. But the moms, they were they were gracious, uh, a little reserved, maybe a little embarrassed. But if there was a dad in the household, he just disappeared. He was gone out the back door. And it dawned on me what was happening was that those parents in front of their own children were being exposed for their inability to provide. And the moms would endure that indignity for the sake of the kids. But it was just more than a, than a father's sense of dignity could handle. It was like his impotence was being exposed in front of his wife and kids in his own living room. Those organizations can change the, that methodology and enter into a much more of an exchange uh, a set of uh, rules or engagement. Uh, the assumption is that no one is so poor that they have nothing to contribute. And so the second Christmas that we were in the neighborhood, as folks started calling in to get their adopted family, we said, would you give an extra gift this year? Would you give a gift of dignity to the dads? And here's how you do it. Go, go shopping, buy toys, but don't wrap them. Bring them down to the community and we'll set up a little store for them. We'll call it the old toy shop. And we'll put somewhere between a wholesale and a garage sale price on those toys. And we'll, we'll invite parents to come in and go shopping. And then on Christmas morning, the parents in our neighborhood will have the same joy as most parents in, in the city have of seeing their kids open the gifts that they have purchased and selected through the efforts of their own hands. And there will be dignity in the process of exchange. And so it's, uh, it's about uh, developing the capacities of those we serve.